Hey you guys, so I finally got my nipple surgery on Tuesday. I am two days post-op and I am finally going to take a shower, take the bandages off and see what these nipples are looking like. So for those that are thinking about getting the nipple reconstruction instead of the 3D, um, you have to get the nipples done first and then you go back and you see a tattoo artist that does a uh, nipple areola coloring and you do about two sessions and then you get your areolas tattooed for the coloring. So um, yeah, I will be back. I'll let you go, guys know how it looks. Unfortunately, this is the end of the road where I can't show them no more because now I have nipples. So you guys wish me luck. Okay, so this is a day after the shower and I seen my nipples. Um, when I did take the bandage off, it was so hard to take the tape off. The tape really hurts. Um, I don't know what type of tape they use, but it definitely hurt. Um, when I finally did see the nipples, um, I didn't know I was going to be emotional, so I did cry. Um, you know, I haven't had nipples since January 6th. And, um, you know, I did take my shower on August 6th. So it was very emotional for me, um, you know, eight months not having a nipple, you know, or seeing anything there, just, you know, having a mold with skin and, you know, just going through the whole breast reconstruction process. Um, they, they did, they, they look like a nipple. They, you know, it wasn't the same nipple as that I had, you know, but um, I'm excited to, um, I get the areola tattooed um, where it definitely looks more you know you know like a real nipple so I'm excited for that um, I definitely go to my post-op on Tuesday so basically um, I had the surgery on a Tuesday and a week from that I go see the post-op and you know he definitely tells me you know how the healing process and everything is going so um, I definitely opt in um, getting the surgery um, the pain wasn't really that bad. Um, they gave me about like 10 oxys and honestly, I took about four. I've been dealing with the pain pretty much. Um, as far as sleeping goes, I just sleep on my back um, and then I sleep cushioned with pillows on my side. Um, that way, you know, if I do try and turn, um, you know, there's a cushion kind of like blocking me. That way I don't sleep and squish the new nipple and everything like that. So, um, you know, to all my breast cancer warriors, fighters, and survivors, um, we are in this together. You know, breast reconstruction, it is a hard process to go through. It's, you know, it's months of, you know, reconstruction. And um, it is it is rough. It's a rough road. And, um, you know, I do commend all my sisters that do go through it. And we're in this together. All right. Love you guys. Bye.